So why do tigers have their stripes? Well, the prevailing hypothesis is that stripes serve as camouflage. See, tigers live and hunt in savannas and forests, where they're hunting in tall grasses and dense vegetation. So it's thought that stripes act as disruptive coloration, breaking up the tiger silhouette in this dense vegetation and dappled light that they hunt in, making it harder for them to be detected by prey. Other cat species also adopt this technique. The blotches, rosés and spots that other cat species have also serve as disruptive coloration, making them harder to see in more densely foliated environments. Now, the reason why tigers have stripes and not spots isn't exactly clear. Arguments can be made that stripes serve as better camouflage in tall grasses and maybe the striped shadows that trees sometimes cast down. However, other spotted cats do co-occur with tigers, like leopards, and they're just as successful. So I think it's just a case of two different solutions to the same problem. So that's the stripes explained, but why are tigers orange? Orange might blend in well with winter foliage in more arid and temperate environments that tigers occupy. Maybe in more green foliage that you get in summer or just year-round in more tropical environments, orange does seem to stand out quite a bit. And that might be true for you and I. However, the large herbivores that tigers prey upon don't actually have photoreceptors in their eyes to detect red light, so they can't actually see red or orange. And so in these dense green environments, tigers don't actually stand out, meaning that their camouflage is still intact and they can remain stealthy predators. Hell, even to animals that can see red, like you and I and other primates, tigers are still very tricky to see in these densely foliated environments. Tigers don't always come in orange and black though. On very rare occasion, tigers might be born with mutations that allow them to display a variety of unique colors and patterns. And we have a full length video on our main channel going over all of these patterns and where they come from. So be sure to go check that out at Odyssey Opus.